Hey guys, welcome back. Today we are going to tackle something very simple that has probably been making you crazy. Now, when you first started with Kajabi, they set things up to make it look very easy for you to do. Like here's your website, you start with your homepage, you kind of go down the list, but then you realize you need to add a few other pages and they don't match. They don't match the homepage. And so now what you want to do is go back in and create a landing page. That's your landing page. But it's tricky when you start to think about how do I send my people now to this new homepage instead of the other one. I'm going to show you how to do it. It's not that hard to do, but you definitely want to do it because you want your website to look consistent throughout. If this is your first time here, you guys welcome. I'm so happy to have you here. I like to do Kajabi tips and tricks, especially for things that you guys have been telling me you need help with. And so if you subscribe, you'll know and you'll see those things come down the pike. I'd also love reviews or comments. Um, if you have something else you want me to cover, I'd love to do that too. If I talk about something, I will link to it in the show notes. So check those out if you have a question. And don't forget at the end of all of these videos, I always check in with Sophie the Beach Bulldog because, well, right now she's resting her head on my foot. You just never know what she's going to be doing, but it's always fun to check in with her. And if you're just kind of exploring Kajabi, you're not quite sure if this is the platform for you, I can tell you I absolutely love this platform. You can have your website, you can have all your email marketing on it, you can do funnels, you can have your courses, you can have your memberships on it. It really does everything. Are there a few areas where it can, could improve? Absolutely, but that's why I'm here to help me, help you kind of walk through those areas. If you haven't tried Kajabi yet and you want to, they do offer a 14 day free trial. I'll link to that in the show notes. If you subscribe using that link, I will actually offer you a bonus, half an hour, one-on-one -on -one with me, so that if you have questions as you're building your website, I can actually personally help you with those. But you have to sign up for Kajabi through the link down there. All right, well, that's it, let's hop in. Okay, so I'm just going to kind of show you um, when you hop into your into your into your site here. What you're going to see is this website link right here, and when you go on there, it looks like here's just the easiest way to set up everything. So if you're going to first set up your home page, you would customize it, and now this has a lot of features that are great to use, but one of the things that I personally don't like is if I add a drop down menu, it's got like this weird arrow thing here that shows up. So it's not consistent because it doesn't look that way on landing pages. So if I were to show you what that one looked like, um, if I just went to that screen and I clicked on that, it goes down. So I, that just doesn't match for most landing screens. My website page that I have right here, it doesn't have that. And so if you create any landing pages where you're also going to use a header, and if you have any kind of drop down menus, that will never match. Um, and there's other reasons why you might want to use a landing page as a home page, but that's just one of the things that I could think of off the top of my head. So if you go back to your main menu here and you go to your website and you want to just design, Instead of creating your home page here, what you're going to do is go to pages and you're going to just create your home page there. Basically, all the other things are the same. You've got sections, you've got blocks, you've, you're able to import images, um, you're able to change like your header size and all of that. So you would just go over here to new page up at the top and just create the new home page. So this is probably where you've gotten stuck. You're like, okay, I have a homepage now, but when whenever I go to home or type in my domain name, this other one pops up because that's the one that the website thinks that I made for my homepage. This is how you change it. You're gonna go down here into your settings and right here at the top, this very first one says site details. You're going to click on that 
and just kind of scroll down here till you get to the part where it says home page. And what instead of showing the normal home page, you're going to tell it to show a landing page. So you can either use the theme home page, which is what we started with. We can show the library so you can require people to sign in right off the bat before they go anywhere, or you can show a landing page. So that's how I have mine set up. And then you just let, let the system know which, which page you want to be the landing page. Another thing this is awesome for is if you are running a promotion like a launch and you want people to type in your website name and you want like just your sales page for your new product cut to come up instead of what you're usually showing, this is where you do it. You just change the home page to whatever that landing page is. It can be whatever you want. And then all you're going to do is save. And now when you type in that website, you're good to go. All right, hope that helped. See you soon. Stay tuned for Sophie if you want to see what she's up to this morning. And also, if you guys want to sign up for Kajabi, remember that you get the one-on-one -on -one with me, the 30 minutes, if you sign up using the link in the show notes. Well, this is what we've got going on now. She's just decided to hang out. So if you okay? You good? You good? <laughs>